Nehemiah, Nehemiah chapter 12. And these were the priests and the Levites who came up with Zerubbabel, son of Shealtiel, and Yeshua, Sariah, Yermeya, Ezra, Amaria, Maluk, Hatush, Shekanya, Rehum, Merimoth, Edo, Ginethoi, Abaya, Miamin, Maadia, Bilga, Shemaya, Yoyarib, Yadaya, Salu, Amok, Hilkaya, and Yadaya. These were the heads of the priests and their brothers in the days of Yeshua and the Levites, Yeshua, Benui, Kadmiel, Sherebia, Yehuda, Matanya, over the thanksgiving, he and his brothers, and Bakbukia and Uni, their brothers, were opposite them for guard duties. And Yeshua brought forth Yoyakim, and Yoyakim brought forth El Yashib, and El Yashib brought forth Yoyoda, Yoyo, Yoyada, and Yoyada brought forth Yonathan, and Yonathan brought forth Yadua. And in the days of Yoyakim the priest, the heads of the father's houses were of Sariah, Mariah, of Yermeah, Hanania, of Ezra, Meshulam, of Amaria, <coughs> Yehochanan, of Meliku, Yonatan, of Shebanya, Yosef, of Harim, Adna, of Meriot, Helkai, of Edo, Zakaria, of Genethon, Meshulam, of Abaya, Zikri, son of Minyamin, of Moadia, Piltai, of Bilga Shamua, of Shemaya Yehonathan, of Yoyarib Matenai, of Yedaya Uzi, of Salai Kalai, of Amok Eber, of Hilkaya Ashabia, and of Yedaya Nethanel, the Levites and priests in the days of El Yashib, Yoyada, Yohanan, and Yadua, were recorded heads of their fathers' houses. Also the priests in the reign of Daryavish, the Persian, the sons of Levi, the heads of the fathers' houses, until the days of Yohanan, son of El Yashib, were written in the books of the annals. And the heads of the Levites are Hashabia, Sherebia, and Yeshua, son of Kadmiel, with their brothers opposite them, to praise, to give thanks, watch opposite watch, according to the command of David, the man of Elohim, Matanya, and Bakbukya, Obadiah, Meshulam, Taman, Akub, were gatekeepers guarding at the storerooms of the gates. These were in the days of Yoyakim, son of Yeshua, son of Yotzadak, and in the days of Nehemiah, the governor, and of Ezra the priest, the scribe, and at the dedication of the wall of Yerushalayim, they set out the Levites in all their places to bring them to Jerusalem to perform the dedication with gladness and with thanksgivings and with singing, cymbals, harps, and lyres. And the sons of the singers gathered together from the countryside around Jerusalem, from the villages of the Nedophathites, and from the house of Gilgal, and from the fields of Geba and Asmaveth, for the singers had built themselves villages all around Jerusalem, and the priests and Levites cleansed themselves, and they cleansed the people, and the gates, and the wall. And I brought the rulers of Yehuda up to the, on the wall, and appointed two large thanksgiving choirs to go to the right on the wall toward the dung gate. And after them went Hashiah, and half of the rulers of Yehuda, then Azariah, Ezra, and Meshulam. Yehuda and Benjamin and Shemaiah and Yermeah, and of the sons of the priests with trumpets, Zechariah, son of Jonathan, son of Shemaiah, son of Matanya, son of Micaiah, son of Zachar, son of Asaph, and his brothers, Shemaiah and Azarel, Melalai, Gilalai, Maai, Nethanel, and Yehuda, Hanani, with his instruments of songs of David, the man of Elohim, with Ezra the scribe before them. 
and at the fountain gate and straight ahead of them they went up the stairs of the city of david and the stairway of the wall between beyond the house of david as far as the water gate eastward and the other thanksgiving choir went over against them and i behind them with half of the people on the wall going past the tower of the ovens as far as the broad wall and above the gate of ephraim and above the old gate and above the fish gate and the tower of hananel and the tower of the hundred as far as the sheep gate and they stood still at the gate of the prison then the two thanksgiving choirs took their stand in the house of elohim and i and half of the deputy rulers with me and the priests eliakim maaseah minyamin micaiah elioenai zechariah and hananiah with trumpets and maaseah and shemaiah and elasar and uzi and yohanan and malchiah and elam and Azer, and the singers sang aloud with Yisrahia in charge. And on that day they slaughtered great slaughterings and rejoiced, for Elohim had made them rejoice with great joy, and the women and the children also rejoiced, so that the joy of Yerushalayim was heard far away. And on that day some were appointed over the rooms for the stores of the contributions for the first fruits and for tithes, to gather into them from the fields of the cities the portions required by the Torah for the priests and for the Levites. For Yehuda rejoiced over the priests and the Levites who stood up. Both the singers and the gatekeepers guarded the charge of their Elohim and the charge of the cleansing according to the command of David and Shlomo his son. For in the days of David and Asaph of old there were chiefs of the singers and songs of praise and thanksgiving to Elohim. And in the days of Zerubbabel, and in the days of Nehemiah, all Yisrael gave the portions for the singers and the gatekeepers, a portion for each day, and they set apart what was for the Levites, and the Levites set apart what was for the children of Aharon.